Caro can defense, advance, but Vinic Carl's defense, 4.dxc5 and c6. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. Black had a good opening, but White was on another level. It was a well-fought middle game that White got the better of. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. In the Karokan defense, the pawns on d7 and d5 can be quickly pushed to take control of the center and engage the e4 pawn. The d4 square seizes the center and launches an assault on the e5 and c5 squares. The pawn on e4 is under attack from the center, where d5. e5 closes the center and controls the important d6 and f6 squares. c5 moves the same pawn twice in the first three moves, but it takes more space in the center and attacks the d4 pawn. dx c5 captures the c5 pawn and allows the queen to attack the d5 pawn. And c6 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the e5 pawn and controls the d4 square. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. This pins a knight, which restricts its mobility. Games Master. It is the final book action. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. It is ideal. This is how you take the pawn. It is ideal. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. Backs off. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. That's good. Recaptures. It is ideal. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. That's good. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is quite good. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. The knight becomes more active as a result, gaining control over more of the board. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. It is best. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is quite good. Castling develops a rook while moving the king to a safer position beyond the board's center. Castling to the same side of the board as your adversary helps you escape some of the attacking that comes with castling to the other side. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This disregards a more effective approach to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. There was only one good move in that position. It is a miss. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. When the queen retreats, this attack wins a tempo. That's good. This is a missed chance to maneuver the queen to safety. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. It is ideal. Thus, the attacked pawn is protected. That is good. This gains time by putting a queen in danger and getting it to flee. It is ideal. By pinning a knight, this increases pressure. It is ideal. 
Black's situation was worse, but now they are losing. It is incorrect. This defends an underdefended pawn that is inadequately attack. That's good. White had the advantage at first, but now they are in the lead. It is incorrect. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. That's good. Backs off. It is ideal. A powerful play. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is quite good. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This passes up the chance to attach a bishop to the king. It is incorrect. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. It is good. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. This threatens to win a queen. It is good. By posing a threat to a knight and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. That's good. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. That's a decent move. That's good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is ideal. This prevents an assault on a rook that might have been taken. That's good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This raises the possibility of exposing an assault on a queen while also deterring the king. It is quite good. This wins a knight. This stops the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a queen while also checking the king. It is best. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Black had a good opening but white was on another level. It was a well-fought middle game that white got the better of.